Hi guys, Mysterious Cat Island, back with more Let's Play Star Ocean. Uh, first contact. <laughs> Not first contact, god damn it, I just had this conversation off screen. It's first departure, first contact, is a Star Trek movie. That's what it was. Alright, we are in pursuit of our friend Millie. Who has gone off to the neighboring town of Kool or Kule, I could not hear exactly how they pronounced it, in an effort to help her dad, because uh, apparently people there are contracting a fever and turning to stone, which is no point. Oh good, we can move the camera. Uh, I'm gonna say the forest ain't got shit to do with this. Let's continue on the road. Look at our little jaunty walk. Uh, celestial ship remains. Okay, we'll we'll check that one out later. I'm a little wary of uh, venturing into places. What's up, Dorn? Oh shit! What's wrong, Dorn? Nothing. It's not nothing. You're lying. Why do you have to lie? Oh my god, this is a long-running thing with characters in these games. I've contracted an illness and I'm gonna lie to you about whether or not I've got it. Uh, and of course a battle. Keep focused, everyone! We got trouble! What do you mean, everyone? There's two of us. Oh my god, they, they can do some damage. Stop that! And we don't have a healer, but she fucking decided to run off. Because that's great. Okay, we need to heal before we go into town. Alright. Oh, holy shit, I gained two levels for that? Shockwave Swirl, okay. And Dorgan can gain... I guess I didn't expect you to get into a fight on the main map. Okay, let's use some of these blueberries. We got them to burn. Whoa, our map is weird looking. I'm actually surprised we have a map already. So everything looks normal. There's an old man, generic sprite. There's Millie, who, oh my god. There's Millie! Who ran here in zero time at all. Oh my god, then why didn't- Fuck. Anybody go. God damn it. People are dumb. People are so fucking dumb. This guy's stone. Sir, uh... We're gonna- Oh man, everybody here is stone. Uh, you're not gonna mind if I take this, right? Thanks. Okay, looks like he's gonna say the same thing about every person, so I'm not gonna go click on all of them. Okay. It's Millie! She's alive! Stay away from me! Well... No matter what you do, don't touch me! Well, we know that. Father. I am done for, Millie. The, the fucking old man at the front of the town said there's something that might help. And you won't let me sit by your side, Father? I can't even hold your hand. Skin contact, dear. I'm sorry. How can something like this happen? Oh, poor baby. Roderick. Dawn. Can you take my daughter back to town for me? Millie, let's go. Except Dorn already has it too! Millie! Aw, oh, damn it, I wanted that I'm chest. Sorry, guys. Girl, don't do it. Wait. Where the hell is Roddick? Planning to go off by yourself? 
That was exactly what she was planning, Dorn. Uh, How did you know? You're going to pick some herbs off the peak of Mount Matorx, aren't you? There's always an herb on a fucking mountain in this game. I in these games, I swear to God. Doesn't take a genius to see what you're thinking. But listen, you can't go into that hornet's nest. Not by yourself. If there are actual hornets here, I'm going to be pissed off. I'm sorry. Let's play Herotic. Three of us will be much better together than just two. Come on, quit pouting. Huh? You're pouting because your dad's gonna die. It'll be okay. Your dad will be fine once we get those herbs. There's no guarantee! Yeah. But... This is terrible. I can't stand seeing you sad like this. It's Bryce Paffenbrook, isn't it? I think it is. Dorn? Millie, I want you to know something. I have feelings for you. I... I... You do! <laughs> God damn Dorn? it. Dorn, what's wrong? Are you alright? Get away from me. What's happening? I'm so oh, mad. No, sorry. I'm fine. <laughs> it's nothing. I said that, but I'm not actually mad. Well, Hold tight just a minute. I'll go find someone. You're a healer. I understand that she's probably panicking now. Rodic, Dorn just collapsed. Not really. Uh, every time something comes up, what's the first thing out of her mouth? Rodic. Rodic. Oh my god, please don't end up betraying me. <laughs> because that's where this usually goes. I fucking remember Final Fantasy IV. Kane is like, I love Rosa, but I also like Cecil. But not necessarily in that way. But now I've been brainwashed, so let me kill Cecil so I can be with Rosa. Over and over and over again. Don't get me wrong, I love Kane. Okay. Right, let's go. Sorry, Dorn. Is it late? I have no sense of time. Okay. I guess it's supposed to be late. There's a slightly darker coloration on things. Don't fucking look collapsed to me, asshole. Are you all right? <laughs> huh? What do you mean? Of course he's all right. Nope, gotta be strong in front of you. Stop jumping to conclusions. I was just a little lightheaded, that's all. I told you. Oh my nothing. god. Roddick, don't you think we ought to go pick some herbs at the peak of Mount Matorx? That ought to be just the thing for Millie's dad. It was my idea first. She should love me for it. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh my god, Roddick, you fucking airhead. Matorx lies due north of Cool. We'll need to watch ourselves. Fucking blue-haired kids in these games, too. There's Roddick who has blue hair in this one. Rena who has blue hair in the next one. Fate who has blue hair in the third one. I don't think anybody has... No, wait, there is a blue-haired character. In, uh... The fourth one. Miracle, I believe her name was? You said it. That's I didn't no use it very often. Up there. Of course it's Fellworm territory, why wouldn't it be? Oh good. Oh, it fucking dark as fuck. Okay. Which, that's interesting, because usually you hit the map and it's just like, pfft, everything's the same. Nothing is any different. Oh, why am I lagging? Well, let's fight. Look out! Everyone ready? Evil bunnies? Yeah, no. Maybe hit him. That would be nice. That one was way easy. too fast. Rosehead, huh? And Millie gained two experience. 
Or two, le two experience. Two experience. God damn it, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. There we go. So. Much in the tradition of older games, they're not gonna tell you where the thing is. You need to find out on your own. What? Okay, so it's not fucking that way. But I'm guessing it's this way. Poor town. We have company. Here they come. Oh, some bandits. No, Millie's gonna die. There we go. Good. She got away. My first fight when I was doing a test run, uh, one of the bandits just went, and Millie was dead. It was <laughs> that fast. I was like, oh shit, no! You can't kill the healer. Not like that. Look out. Ugh, more bandits. Ready? Fucking bandits. Oh, of course Doran's gonna go protect Millie. Why wouldn't he? Sorry, I mean, you know, love triangles don't have to end in sorrow for any person. There are ways around that. Okay. Well, I'm wondering if that's not the mountain behind the village. Guess we'll find out. Well, that old man's dead. He got stoned too. Oh, what? Is there stuff in that chest now? Oh. There was always... Ooh, yeah, your dad's still there. Ha ha ha! Actually, let's see if I can get that chest. Is he gonna say something about it? Probably not. 200 full, nice. Ha ha, but I did it anyway! I'll do what I want, Dad! You don't own me! You're not my real dad! Yeah, still says the same thing. Okay. It's a little Aztec y looking. Running forever. Yeah, this seems like it's gonna be the way up the mountain. And fights! We have company! Here More bandits. Yeah. No? None of you guys are coming this way? Good dumbasses. Just slamming the button. Well, fuck. That one was easy. Longer. Spectacles. I need to look at some of this stuff because I don't remember what a lot of these items do. It's been. It's been quite a long time since I've played a Star Ocean game. A uh, necklace offers some protection. Oh, and spectacles are like magic lenses. Oh, let's put it on me. Yep, that works. Oh, I should check out what the rose hips are. Uh, okay. Weird. Like, you use rose hips in tea. Rose hip tea is good. It's been a long time since I've had it. Oh, sorry if I sneeze on camera, guys. Of course it's swarming with fell worms, why wouldn't it be? Oh, that's so gross! Great! Sounds perfect. I, I honestly can't think of anything better. Everybody's HP is okay. Ugh, why are you slimy? I don't like bugs. This looks bad. We got trouble. Just wail on it so it doesn't lay its gross eggs on you. There we go. That wasn't too bad. That one was way too fast. They called fell worms because they fell off the cliff. Oh great! Neat. Yeah, that was actually 
not too bad of a fight. Yeah. Yep, they're gross. But their eggs would have to be, you know, a decent size. Even though they're bugs, and bugs tend to lay, you know, like, sacks of eggs, and they're... Oh, that's dumb. Why the fuck did it turn me around? Maybe it didn't. Maybe I turned me around. That's the likelihood. Be careful, everyone! Oh, fucking flying shit in these games. I swear to god. Bam, got him. That one was easy. Doran, quit wiggling your butt at the camera. It's weird. Now, let's see. Learn skills. We've got 11 skill points to burn, but it doesn't look like we have any skills right now. So we'll look at that. I don't remember how the skill system works in the other game. <laughs> the other games. It's been. It's been a while. Uh, I played. Most notably, Star Ocean 4 when it came out. I played it on the we Xbox. Got we can't lose this. And that was. I played it shortly after it came out. And then I have not picked it up since. I did start playing three more easy. recently, right. or replaying three more the recently, but it still wasn't, it had to have been like five years ago. Of course, You're Dorn, right. no, he's not alright. Don't touch me. I've got the disease. What? I'm just worried about you. You don't have to yell at me like that. He doesn't want you getting sick, girl. No, it's nothing. Don't worry about me. It's because he loves you. And he's jealous of Roddick. Wait, you didn't catch the... He did! I must have caught it when I touched that carrier pigeon. I knew it! I knew it! Oh, man. <gasps> oh, no. Well, just gives us all the more reason to hustle. Oh wait, it's been like three days. We better go back home. Uh, not a whole lot of point in turning around now. No, I'm fine. I haven't started turning into stone yet. But fucking diseases where you turn to stone in these games. I said I'm fine. Don't be an asshole. Sorry, but I'm fine, really. I'm just in like an enormous amount of pain. Besides, those herbs will cure me anyway, right? Maybe. Let's keep yeah, I. What the hell is this? Is this a thing I can investigate, or is it just a? Aha! Neat. I only barely saw that. <sighs> Cutscene. There's the flower that we need. And of course, we're gonna have to fight a thing, or not. I thought there wasn't supposed to be anyone here. There weren't any life forms here, Captain. When I scanned the area. Who are you? What do you want? Have you come here to take the herbs away from us? Where did you come from? Look, you don't have to be so... Stay where you are! Uh, ...so afraid. Uh, <laughs> that didn't work. No, of I course it didn't work. Just really weird and I don't trust you! Well, you see, my name is... You Robert also have a bad haircut. How can I explain this so it makes sense? Captain, huh? allow me. <sighs> my name's Elia Silvestri. And please, before you say anything, I want you to know that we're not your enemy. We're here to help you. Uh? <laughs> okay. Before you say anything, I want to let you know that we are not I like enemy. Blondie. Ilya. One of the things that annoys me is Millie's tail is the only one that's really animated, and I get because it's, it's supposed to be cute. But still. Really? It's supposed to make her appear girlish. 
in nature. The high ponytail does enough of that. Well, they sure aren't our friends. Not these strangers. They are strange looking, aren't they? Notice the lack of tail and pointy ears. We're here to pick some of the herbs off of this mountain, that's all. I should tell you that these herbs won't stop anyone from turning into stone. And how do you know that, Ilya? How? Who are you? That is a very good... Well, she already gave us her name, but yeah, that's still a good question. You're interested in listening to us now? Yes. All right, go. <laughs> go, get away from here. I'm sure you won't believe us at first, but we've come from a place far, far away to save all of you. White Savior Syndrome! <laughs> no, 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 I'm kidding. They're supposed to be Japanese. So why didn't you come sooner then? Uh, they're from outer space, Roddick, if you hadn't guessed. We can't make direct contact with civilizations in the early stages of development. It's part of the Underdeveloped Planet Preservation Pact. If you play other Star Ocean games, that fucking UP3 is gonna come back to haunt you. That's what they call it in later games. It's the same damn thing. They don't know what that is. Early stages of development? Yes. This is medieval period for you guys. We came here from beyond the sky, from another planet. We're making something of a special exception to the rule, you see. Which you're not supposed to do, and several characters in other games completely bitch about that. I'm looking at you, fate. Star from three. Beyond the sky? Another planet? Yeah? Are you gods? A valid question. No, we're not gods. We're people, just like you. Well, uh, except without the tails. You would be super cute with the tail, though. Just saying. Oh, See, look at my wow. butt. No tail. I believe that... I thought there were people that lived on Felpool that didn't have tails. I don't remember. It's been so long. Lazonia, a force opposing our own, broke the underdeveloped planet preservation pact recently. And, and that's why we're breaking it. Interference with this planet. As if that weren't bad enough, they also fired a biological weapon at you. Okay, that's shitty. A contagion that spread across this whole area. Oh. So we're turning into stone, and it's because of those Lazonia guys. This is often the problem. Some mysterious alien force is causing the thing that X character has to stop. Correct. I can't believe this. And that's okay. That's perfectly within your right. here to examine the disease and try to find a treatment for it. Oh, so this is not something they're doing on their own. So you see, we've come here to help. God, I hate your haircut. Probably I really do not like your imagine. haircut. I want to go look at that plant. I still can't believe any of this, but can you really help with the cure? Well, they don't look evil, and they really were in the opening theme, but so. If you're able to save our friend here. And Millie's dad, Roddick. God. If you come with us and help us in creating a vaccine, we should be able to cure him. Where do you want them to go? Vaccine? Yeah, vaccinations didn't start until much later in civilization's development. Um, uh, a miracle medicine, sort of. No, that's not a right way to... Explain vaccines. But I get what she was going for. God, your haircut is stupid. Before we go any further, I don't know that I'm ever gonna get over it. Decide to come with us. You'll probably never see this planet again. What the fuck? How is that okay to tell them? Why not? Well, I mean, I guess it's better that you tell them than just pick them up off the planet and be like, well, you're never going to go home. That's what the rules say. If you interact with us too much, 
We can't let you go back to your original life. That's stupid. That's another part of the underdeveloped planet preservation pact. Ugh, somebody really liked that alliteration there, didn't they? Now, if you'd like, we could go our separate ways, and you could pretend this was all some kind of fever dream. There is still time for that. <laughs> We're aliens. Hello. Well, I'm going with these guys. All I've got waiting for me here is life as a statue. That is absolutely true, Dorn. You can't do that. You want me to choose between losing you forever or losing my father and everyone else forever? That is a tough Don't choice. Don't make me do that, Dorn. Millie, let's go with Dorn too. I'm sorry to break this to you, but there's just nothing we can do if we stay here. That is also true. Why you gotta be the moderator, Roddick? That's really supposed to be Dorn's job. I know it's hard leaving everyone you know in Kratos, but we've got a bigger job ahead. We're like, I know this everybody. is based on an older game, but like, the amount of belief they're already putting in this is a little weird. Well, it's settled then. Might as well get going. Close your eyes for a moment, please. Hmm. Huh? Yes, because let's absolutely trust that. Close your eyes, dear. That's probably why. Beam us up, bitch! Okay, well... That seems like as good a place to leave off as any. So we'll pick it up in the next one, guys. And we'll, uh... Figure out where the fuck we are. What was that? Well... That's a good question. We're going to answer that with the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.